Hi everyone. Welcome to Level Up Channel. In today's video, I present a list of 10 highest dividend yield stocks from the S&P 500. The S&P 500 is a stock market index that tracks the performance of 500 large cap companies listed on the US stock exchanges. The index is widely regarded as a benchmark for the overall performance of the US stock market and is one of the most widely followed stock market indices in the world. The S&P 500 index is weighted by market capitalization, which means that the largest companies by market value have a greater impact on the index than smaller companies. The index includes companies from a broad range of industries, including technology, financial services, healthcare, consumer goods, and energy. The S&P 500 is maintained by Standard & Poor's, a financial services company that provides credit ratings, market intelligence, and investment research. The index is updated periodically to reflect changes in the stock market, such as mergers, acquisitions, and bankruptcies. Investing in high-yield dividend stocks can encourage investors to focus on companies that have a consistent record of profitability and cash flow. This can help to mitigate the risk of investing in speculative or high-growth companies that may not be able to sustain their business models over the long term. Now let's get into it. Stock 1, Arbor Realty Trust. Beginning its operations in 2003, Arbor Realty had a modest portfolio of structured real estate loans. Since then, the company has expanded into one of the industry's most diverse mortgage REITs. Currently, structured loans generate about a third of Arbor's revenue. In order to acquire properties until permanent financing can be acquired, this company usually offers bridge loans to real estate owners and developers that require short-term capital, often between one and three years. Before they can start producing consistent income flows for the owner, the majority of the property's Arbor funds need to be renovated. Shorter-term bridge financing is advantageous to borrowers because it gives the property time to increase in value without burdening it with onerous long-term debt. Dividend yield, 12.20%. Dividend safety, 50. Dividend growth, 16% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 10 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $17.50 per share which represents a 30% upside potential. Stock 2, Best Buy. Best Buy Company Incorporated sells technology products and retail stores in the US and Canada. Domestic and international business segments make up the company's operations. Its stores sell consumer electronics including digital imaging, health and fitness, home theater, portable audio including headphones and portable speakers, and smart home products. Computing and mobile phones are also offered, including computing covering desktops, notebooks, and peripherals, mobile phones including related mobile network carrier commissions, networking products, tablets covering e-readers, and wearables, such as smartwatches. The company's stores also sell entertainment products like drones, peripherals, movies, music, and toys, as well as gaming hardware and software, virtual reality and other software, as well as appliances like dishwashers, laundry machines, ovens, refrigerators, and vacuum cleaners. Dividend yield, 4.68%. Dividend safety, 80. Dividend growth, 19% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 19 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $96 per share which represents a 23% upside potential. Stock 3, International Business Machines. International Business Machines Corporation offers integrated solutions and services worldwide. In addition to providing software for vertical and domain-specific solutions, its cloud and cognitive software segment also provides customer information control system and storage, analytics and integration software solutions, and customer on-premise workload support services for the banking, airline, and retail sectors. These application areas include weather, asset management, health, financial services, supply chain, and security software and services. Additionally, it provides middleware and data platform software, such as Red Hat, which enables clients' hybrid multi-cloud environments to function, as well as Cloud Pox, WebSphere Distributed, and Analytics Platform software, including DB2 Distributed, Information Integration, and Enterprise Content Management, as well as IoT, Blockchain, and AI-Watson platforms. Dividend Yield, 5.24%. Dividend Safety, 65. Dividend Growth, 2% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend Growth Streak, 28 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $160 per share which represents a 27% upside potential. Stock 4, MPLX. 
MPLXLP owns and operates midstream energy infrastructure and logistics assets primarily in the United States. Logistics and storage and gathering and processing make up its two operational components. Gathering, processing, and transporting natural gas, gathering, fractionating, exchanging, storing, and marketing natural gas liquids, transporting, storing, distributing, and marketing crude oil and refined petroleum products, as well as other hydrocarbon-based products, and selling residual gas and condensate are all activities that the company engages in. Its network of pipelines spans the whole United States and Alaska. Storage caverns for butane, propane, and liquefied petroleum gas are located in Neal, West Virginia, Woodhaven, Michigan, Robinson, Illinois, and Jal, New Mexico, and its maritime sector owns and manages boats and barges. Dividend yield, 8.97%. Dividend safety, 41. Dividend growth, 5% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 10 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $44 per share which represents a 29% upside potential. Before getting to the last stock, please push the like button to help grow the channel. It takes me a lot of energy to do the research and try to come up with a good content. I would really appreciate it. Now, let's go on. Stock 5, One Oak. One Oak Incorporated, with its subsidiaries, engages in gathering, processing, storage, and transportation of natural gas in the United States. Natural gas collecting and processing, natural gas liquids, and natural gas pipelines are its three main business segments. Throughout the Mid-Continent and Rocky Mountain regions, the firm has natural gas gathering pipelines and processing facilities. Natural gas liquids, NGL, are also collected, processed, fractionated, and transported in addition to being stored, sold, and distributed. Dividend yield, 5.92%. Dividend safety, 54. Dividend growth, 6% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 34 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $81 per share which represents a 26% upside potential. Stock 6, Walgreens Boots Alliance. Walgreens Boots Alliance Incorporated operates as a pharmacy-led health and beauty retail company. It operates through three segments, Retail Pharmacy USA, Retail Pharmacy International, and Pharmaceutical Wholesale. Through its retail drugstores, the Retail Pharmacy USA sector sells prescription medications along with a range of retail goods, including goods for personal care, consumables, general items, wellness, and beauty. Moreover, it offers mail services and specialist pharmacy services. As of August 31, 2020, this sector ran six, specialty pharmacies, 9,021 retail locations in the U.S. under the Walgreens and Duane Reed brands. In addition to providing related services to pharmacies and other healthcare providers, the pharmaceutical wholesale sector participates in the wholesale and distribution of specialty and generic pharmaceuticals, health and beauty products, and home healthcare supplies and equipment. This market segment operates in the Netherlands, Turkey, Spain, Egypt, Norway, Romania, the Czech Republic, Germany, France, the United Kingdom, and Lithuania. Dividend yield, 5.77%. Dividend safety, 79. Dividend growth, 5% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 91 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $45 per share which represents a 36% upside potential. Stock 7, Black Hills. Black Hills operates as an electric and natural gas utility company in the United States. It operates in two divisions, gas and electric utilities. Over 220,000 electric utility customers in Colorado, Montana, South Dakota, and Wyoming receive electricity from the electric utilities business, which also owns and manages 1,482 megawatts of production capacity and 9,024 kilometers of electric transmission and distribution lines. In Arkansas, Colorado, Iowa, Kansas, Nebraska, and Wyoming, the gas utilities segment distributes natural gas to about 1,107,000 natural gas utility customers. It also owns and operates 4,713 miles of interstate gas transmission pipelines, 42,222 miles of gas distribution mains and service lines, 7 natural gas storage sites, and 515 miles of gathering lines with a combined capacity of about 50,000 horsepower along with providing appliance repair services to household utility customers and electrical system construction services to large industrial clients, the company also builds and maintains gas infrastructure facilities for customers in the gas transportation industry. Dividend yield, 
4.18%. Dividend safety, 77. Dividend growth, 6% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 52 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $68 per share which represents a 15% upside potential. Stock 8, Consolidated Edison. The 10 million people who reside in and around New York City are currently supplied with energy by the utility. The transmission and distribution of electric, gas, and steam power are regulated activities that provide for the majority of Consolidated Edison's revenue. Con Edison has become a very resilient corporation due to its focus on regulated utilities, the industry's gradual transformation, and its recession-resistant services. Few businesses that essentially offer the same solution to their clients' problems have been in business since the 19th century. Con Edison's management has been able to increase the dividend every year since 1975, thanks to this consistency, which is the longest run of annual payout increases of any S&P 500 utility business. Dividend yield, 3.58%. Dividend safety, 90. Dividend growth, 3% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 48 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company is $103 per share which makes the stock a little overvalued right now. Stock 9, 3M. 3M company develops, manufactures, and markets various products worldwide. Safety and industrial, transportation and electronics, healthcare, and consumer make up its four business segments. The safety and industrial business serves the industrial, electrical, and safety markets with personal safety goods, industrial adhesives and tapes, abrasives, closure and masking systems, automotive aftermarket, and roofing granules. The transportation and electronics offers electronics to original equipment manufacturers of transportation and electronics, including display materials and systems, electronic materials solutions, automotive and aerospace, and commercial solutions, advanced materials, and transportation safety products. Medical and surgical supplies, dental care, separation and purification sciences, health information systems, drug delivery systems, and food safety items are all provided to the healthcare business by the healthcare segment. Dividend yield, 5.77%. Dividend safety, 60. Dividend growth, 5% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 64 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company could reach $122 per share which represents a 17% upside potential. Stock 10, Whirlpool. Whirlpool manufactures and sells home appliances and related products and services in North America, Europe, the Middle East, Africa, Latin America, and Asia. The company's main offerings include mixers, cooking and other small domestic appliances, dishwasher appliances and related accessories, freezer appliances, refrigerators, freezers, ice makers, and refrigerator water filters, laundry appliances, commercial laundry products, and related laundry accessories. Dividend yield, 5.33%. Dividend safety, 70. Dividend growth, 10% per year in the last 5 years. Dividend growth streak, 32 years. According to analysts, the price target of the company is $150 per share which makes the stock a little overvalued right now. This is it. Remember, I am not a financial advisor. Don't forget to make your own due diligence before investing. I hope the list helps add some companies to your watch list and maybe portfolio. Please push the like button if you like the video and subscribe to the channel for similar content. I'll see you next time.